What's up guys, Andy here with another episode of Tap Lab, and today we're going to be talking about a new update to Bitmoji called Bitmoji Deluxe. And this is an interesting one because now they'll allow you to take a photo of yourself and then it'll build out a Bitmoji for you based on your photo. And this is cool because I have a previous video, let's see if we can find it here on the channel new bitmoji feature ideas this video is about one year old and i talk about the struggles that bitmoji currently has and i talk about this exact thing how they should allow you to take a photo of yourself and build out a bitmoji for you so that's cool that something i talked about a year ago finally came to life so let's take a look at this what we want to do is tap on our bitmoji on the top left and then you may have a new interface here i'm still on the old one i haven't gotten the update yet but you want to tap on the bitmoji icon then it's going to take you to this screen and then what you want to do is tap edit bitmoji and that's just going to take you straight into the bitmoji app if you don't already have a bitmoji you can download the bitmoji app and create one here so then once you come here it will take you to a screen similar to this it'll probably give you a prompt like hey we have this new feature check it out then you'll click a button enable the camera and then it will take you to something like this. Now what we wanna do is just put our face in the center of this circle and then hit the camera button right here. And then based on the photo that you take, it's gonna build out a Bitmoji for you. So it was sort of accurate for me. It gave me like a weird hairstyle, so I had to switch that. But go ahead and do it for yourself and see how accurate it is. And then once you've done that, you can come down here and change anything that you wanna change. And they've added tons of different options, skin tones, uh, tons of different hairstyles that's a hair color the hairstyles here and then each one of these uh, icons down here on the bottom of the screen has more options so hair treatment there's none of that yet lots of different new facial hair options you can change the color on almost any of these by tapping the little droplet thing different eye shapes eyelashes now you can change the eye size like make that style bigger or smaller you can change the distance between the eyes the color eyebrows noses you can add glasses now they have a lot of uh, sunglasses options i noticed if you scroll down here no spectacles though so that's interesting why don't you have spectacles jaw lines ears cheek lines all kinds of stuff. You can add eyeshadow, blush, lipstick, lots of different hats. I had a hat on mine before, but I took that off. I don't really like that they only have this one style of normal baseball caps. Body type. And then you can change the outfit. I think all of the outfits are the same as before. And then you just want to hit the check mark in the top right or in the bottom right. Then you can save your avatar and you're good to go. And there you have it, how to use the new Bitmoji Deluxe. Take a photo of yourself and have that build out a Bitmoji for you. It's a lot easier for people who didn't quite understand how to do it before, or there wasn't enough options to make it look like themselves. You can always tap right here to open that up and see sort of what you look like and go in and change it. So that's all I got for this video. I hope you guys found this helpful. Be sure to drop a comment down below and let me know if you have any questions and I'll try and answer those. Also, let me know what you think of this new Bitmoji update. Check out my other social media, subscribe to my other YouTube channels. I'll link it all down in the description. I'll see you guys next time.